Today is International Tabletop Day, and we're starting it off at a fundraiser for RenCon. Uh, RenCon was one of the first places that we... <laughs> yes, we are shameless promoters, that's right. <laughs> so, we are, we are. We'll be there uh, this afternoon, yeah, from 4 to 7, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's fantastic. You're welcome. You're welcome. Oh, great. Thank you so much. Have you tried playing bears with him? What? Have you tried playing bears with him? I've not. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, if you get a chance today, we'd love to show it to you. You might enjoy that one also. Awesome, awesome, sure. So, as, uh, as I was uh, about to say, um, we are um, here at a fundraiser for, for Rencon, and uh, Justin is showing some people how to how to play Castle Panic the expansion, and uh, the guys over at the other table were talking about our uh, appearance later today at Amazing Discoveries, so we'll be there as well. We've had several people come up at the Rencon fundraiser to say that they've been excited about coming here. Um, the father and son that you see here playing the expansion uh, came here expressly for uh, Castle Panic, so they are thrilled to be able to learn the game from the designer himself. So, and of course, Justin always loves uh, teaching his games to, to people. So we're excited about turning on another family uh, to uh, to the game. So uh, we'll see how the rest of the convention goes. Who knows? Maybe we'll actually have time to play games uh, other than our own. So we're excited about that. Happy International Tabletop Day! We're going driving through Texas Canyon now. We're still in Arizona. But um, Texas Canyon has all these really cool rock formations. Let's see if I can get some over here. There's some really cool like uh, rocks that are balanced on each other. So I'm not really seeing the, the dramatic ones yet. See if we can find one. We're on our way back to San Antonio right now, leaving Arizona. So we'll hit New Mexico and move to Texas and El Paso. I think that was it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh well. <laughs> yeah. It's really just that pass. Yeah. yeah. Well, Justin, do you have any thoughts as we're leaving Arizona? <laughs> Coffee. I wish I wasn't sick. Yeah. <laughs> There's one. You and me both. Yeah, exactly. We managed to get sick right after tabletop day. So we made it through and then uh, both get sick. Um, well, it's been good. I'm actually kind of looking forward to getting back to our old stomping grounds. It's going to feel like a little bit of a break in the tour without being the actual end of the tour because our plan is to turn around in a few months and go back out and do more. So it'll be nice to see some friends, get some work done and things like that. So been good. I mean, California was really impressive. Gamma was good. And uh, Tucson, while it wasn't quite what we expected, it was still really neat to see it. You know, it's another part of the, the nation now that we know how that works. We've made some new contacts, made some new fans. Yeah. The gaming in Tucson is really interesting. Lots of designers and some publishers mm -hmm. there. And, uh... A lot of uh, up and coming. It's, it reminds yeah. me of Austin a lot. There's yeah. a lot of designers that are out there doing their thing. Some are yeah. published, some are up and coming. A lot of Kickstarter projects and stuff. Yeah. 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 Quite the little hotbed of game design, actually. Uh -huh. Yeah, they seem to be more active in their meetup groups and kind of individually than they are active in the stores themselves. Yeah, that's so. kind of the impression I get, mm -hmm. yeah. I'd be curious to see, we heard uh, some talk that Phoenix has uh, not as active as a community, but more stores and yeah. like that. So I'll be yeah. curious to see how that works. Uh -huh. uh, my Me guess too. is they probably are plenty active in those stores, but yeah. we'll see. It'll be kind of fun to see a different take on the same state and uh, big city versus smaller city kind of thing. Yeah, that's true. All right, so you know you're traveling through the middle of the desert when you have a classical station. Something that's making no noise whatsoever. And that's it on the radio. That is all the stations we get out here. We're, we're still in Arizona getting close to the border to Mexico, but uh, there's, uh, yeah, nothing. <laughs> that's all you get, kids.